When you're living in homelessness during the winter months, there are things that are essential for your survival. You need a lot of water, and usually there's a couple good places to buy either gallons of water for someone's opportunities, or small six packages or six bottles of water for a dollar or so. And that's very helpful. Even a $2.30 24 set is great, and you can usually buy that from ruler stores. And that's really marvelous. At the same time, you need flavor packets. Flavor packets are usually the flavor packets of an orange or lemonade or a lemon iced tea. Most people today will enjoy those, and that's fine. When it comes to dinner time, though, they need protein, not snack foods, not chips, not candy, not cookies. We need protein, and protein is things like the marvelous Great Value Chicken or Great Value Pulled Pork, which is my preference. It's really good. And openly, it kind of comes in its own sort of barbecue Swedish type of a sauce, at least the one that I tried. And openly, it's a good value. The can is well packed. Other types of things like roast beef and other things are not as well packed. There's not as much value in the can for the dollar. We encourage people to always provide proteins and then consider some sort of beverage like a can of Arizona tea or a case of that or a can of lemonade or a case of that usually you can buy those things at Aldi's and the box of course comes sealed the value is that it's canned and it cannot be easily uh, covered in something like COVID or flu because a can is something that you usually wipe off anyway before you drink from it and that's okay we also have other needs to stay warm in the streets and that is usually the value of some sort of an iced tea in a can because you can actually heat that can up if you have a way some sort of a Bunsen burner stove or a way to put things in a little bit of water to do that like we would if we were camping someplace we would heat up the can gently carefully but nothing that's a soda pop obviously with a carbonate in it which would not be wise at the same time you can transfer that into a small if you have them sort of plug in uh, type of a not crock pot but some sort of a hot pot and I used to have one in college that was just perfect for one person or two people to eat out of and it handled cooking all sorts of things like tea when I needed it for me to stay awake or some sort of a ravioli and that was great not hard to carry and literally could fit in a backpack but those are hard to find sometimes other things that people need to eat of course are a little bit of potatoes so a plain or low salt potato chip is helpful so the person doesn't dry themselves out with the salt content and openly some sort of canned pineapple is usually a good bet or canned mandarin oranges anything in a low syrup is best